Oregon State hosting Utah, and Oregon State are anywhere between three and a half and four and a half point favorites. The over under is at 44 and a half points. Utah are plus 152 on the money line, and Oregon State are minus 184. Now, use a site like VegasInsider.com. It'll allow you to compare all the sportsbooks' pricings in one place because depending upon what side of this game you want, you may want to shop around to find the most advantageous line for you. Now, head-to-head, Utah is 7-3 and three against Oregon in their last 10 meetings. They did beat them in the last game that they played them last year. They were home. The home team has won the last three games that they've played against each other, understandably so. It's just a matter of, and the over has hit in the last three games. And I know with college football, people don't like me going way, way back. So the underdog has covered two out of the last three games that they've played against each other. Or uh, Utah was the favorite last year, and they won and covered that game. Now, so far this year, Utah is a perfect 4-0. They're 2-1-1 against the spread, and the under is 4-0 in the games in which they've played. For Oregon State, they're 3-1. They're 2-2 against the spread, and the over is 3-1 in the games in which they've played. Now, the last four games that they've played against each other, there's been a total of 58 76, 54, and 59 points. So the over-under being as low as what it is is a tad bit concerning to me. Now, Utah beat UCLA 14-7, uh, Weber 31-7, Baylor 20-13, Florida 24-11. Oregon State did lose to Washington, or Washington State 38-35, uh, then they won 26-29, 155-7, and 142-7. To 17. I think Utah wins this game. I understand that the home field is huge in college football, but we'll see how Oregon State bounces back after that loss. I'm going to take Utah with the money line. I'm going to take Utah getting as many points as I possibly can. As of right now, that's four and a half, and I'm going over in this game. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.